Edible mushrooms are types of mushrooms that are safe and suitable for human consumption. There are many varieties of edible mushrooms, and they can be found in many different parts of the world. Some common examples of edible mushrooms include button mushrooms. These are the most commonly consumed mushrooms, and they have a mild flavor that goes well with many different types of dishes. Portobello mushrooms, these large, Meaty mushrooms are often used as a vegetarian substitute for burgers and steaks. Shiitake mushrooms, these have a rich, earthy flavor and are often used in Asian dishes. Oyster mushrooms, these have a delicate, slightly sweet flavor and a velvety texture. Morel mushrooms, these are prized for their nutty, earthy flavor and are often used in gourmet cooking. It is important to note that while many mushrooms are edible, there are also many that are toxic and can cause serious health problems or even death. It is essential to properly identify and verify the edibility of any mushroom before consuming it. It is best to consult an expert or a guidebook on mushroom identification before consuming any wild mushrooms. An edible mushroom is a type of mushroom that is safe for human consumption and can be used as food. Edible mushrooms come in a variety of shapes, sizes, and flavors, and they are consumed all over the world. Mushrooms have many potential health benefits. They are low in calories and fat, but high in nutrients like vitamin D, B vitamins, and antioxidants. Some types of mushrooms also contain compounds that may have anti-inflammatory or immune-boosting effects. How to grow mushrooms in a bucket Growing mushrooms in a bucket is a simple and convenient way to cultivate your own fresh mushrooms at home. Here are the steps to follow. Materials needed 5-gallon bucket with lid Drill and drill bit Mushroom spawn can be purchased online or at a gardening store or substrate materials such as sawdust or straw, water, thermometer, plastic bag or container for misting. Steps. Drill several small holes in the sides of the bucket for airflow. Drill several larger holes in the lid for the mushrooms to grow through. Fill the bucket with substrate material leaving a few inches of space at the top. Add the mushroom spawn to the substrate. Follow the instructions on the package for the amount to use. Mix the substrate and spawn thoroughly, making sure the spawn is evenly distributed. Place the lid on the bucket and store it in a dark, humid location with a consistent temperature between 60-75 F-15-24 C. Check the temperature regularly with a thermometer and mist the substrate with water as needed to keep it moist. Within a few weeks, you should start to see mycelium growing on the substrate. When the mycelium has fully colonized the substrate, Remove the lid and cover the substrate with a damp plastic bag or container. This will create a humid environment that is ideal for fruiting. Keep the substrate in a well-lit area but out of direct sunlight. Spray the substrate with water several times a day to maintain high humidity. After a few days, you should see mushrooms starting to grow through the holes in the lid. Harvest the mushrooms by gently twisting and pulling them off the substrate. Note different types of mushrooms require different types of substrate and spawn, so be sure to do your research and choose the right materials for the type of mushrooms you want to grow. Thank you for watching. For more of these videos be sure to like and subscribe to my channel or I will prick your nose if you don't. Ha ha ha. Just kidding, bye.